Hi guys, welcome to another video. Today we're going to be talking about the best sniper and AR setup in Warzone right now. That is the FFAR and the Car 98. We're going to be running through the best class setups for each gun. And we're going to be showing some content at the end. Hope you enjoy. If you like it, smash that like button. Smash that subscribe button. And enjoy the content. Thank you. Peace. So this is my Car 98 and FFAR build. We start off with the agency suppressor with sound suppression and damage range. It's a no-brainer for Warzone. Next, I use the reinforced heavy barrel for 51% bullet velocity increase and effective damage range. But you can use the Ranger. It does add 85% bullet velocity. But I just feel like I don't know what it is. This barrel just feels better for me personally. Um, the ender barrel. So, again, this is down to preference. A lot of people use the field agent grip. I've used it. I also use the bruiser grip. And I just feel the bruiser is just better for me, especially with vertical recoil. It's a lot easier to control. So, that's the reason why I use the bruiser four grip. Um, next. You have to use the 50 round fast mag for this gun. It literally burns through ammo. You have to use it. You can use the standard, but obviously the reload time, I guess, and if you're playing solos or duos, you could use the 50 round mag. But if you're playing any more than that, you, you need the fast round mag. So, so yeah, the last then is the optic. Again, I'm using it with a sniper. I don't need a three time, I don't need a two time optic. I just want something to a nice clean sight. So I use the 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 microflex LED, nice clean red dot sight, perfect for war zone, um and perfect for running with a sniper. Talking of sniper, let's go and have a look at our car ninety eight build. So again, you've got to start off with a monolithic suppressor. Sound suppression, damage range, perfect. It's what you need in Warzone, keeps you off the minimap. Adds that extra range with the long distance fighting in Warzone. Next, I use the Shingard Custom 27.6 barrel. Why? Damage range, bullet velocity. They are the main two for me. Recoil control, it's a sniper, it's not that bad of a recoil. Um, this is the reason I mainly use it always, just for that damage range and that bullet velocity. Next, we've got a tack laser. I, I like my sniper to be quite snappy, ADS in fast, but this also has aim stability, which I'll explain a little bit later on why that is quite important, especially for this gun. But, but yeah, that's a must have the tack laser. Again, optic. I use the sniper scope. A lot of people use um, the, the variable zoom scope. For me, I just push down too much and end up zooming in, zooming out. It's just not for me. So I just use the the standard sniper scope. Um, it's more than enough zoom at distance for me. And I just prefer it. Last but not least, the stock. Now, I never used to run a stock in the car 98, but running this stock has really, really helped. The aim stability on this gun with this stock on is so good, you don't need to hold your breath while taking long range shots. It literally does not move. You literally, you have your crosshair. If you put that little white dot on their head and zoom in, you are not moving from their head. It is so good. It is so stable. This is why I use that. Um, please check these builds out. Use them for yourself. Let me know if they work. And trust me, you will not be disappointed. This is such a powerful class at all ranges. This is going to be the new meta of Warzone. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Smash that like. Smash that sub button. And enjoy the rest of the video. Peace. Oh, look at that one.
position. 